exam. So I wanted to do a key through certain things and then bring one with me to Samoa when I'm going for the next two and a half years. So here we go. Yay. Um, this is one suitcase and this is my like stuff suitcase where the other one is just like clothing. So basically what they've done in the past is like you get one suitcase for the first two months of your life there. Um, which like I figure will mostly be like clothes and like water bottles and like just notebooks and whatever like I need need. And then this is the like fun suitcase. Yoga. So I'm bring you a yoga mat. It's pretty. It has mountains on it, but I'm not gonna unroll it all the way. But it, it's nice. I like it a lot. Got it last year. Snorkel. Bringing a snorkel. Um, it's an island. I don't know if we'll be anywhere close to the beach, or I'll fall swim more than like twice my entire time there. I am bringing. I got so many face masks because I like to do face masks, and it's fun, and I figure what better way to bond with other Peace Corps volunteers than just be like, you want to do a face mask with me? Because, like, at times it's going to be stressful, and I really enjoy doing face masks. So I got um, this Aztec secret stuff that I hear is just, like, the best face mask ever, and also there's a lot of it, so it'll make more than like my sheet masks will and then I also got like whip soap scrub um just because I need another like wash or uh, Dr. Bronner's I'm sorry Dr. Bronner's which is like the soap to end all soap it's like insanely fucking strong soap I don't know how it is but it's basically like an inflatable hammock on the ground. I don't, I don't really know. The Peace Corps on their packing list suggests hammocks, but then um, in like people's personal packing lists that they sent us and we're like, hey, this is stuff that you should and shouldn't bring. They were like, don't bring a hammock. You're never going to use it. The bugs are like way too bad to be just outside in one place for that long, not doing anything um, and just chilling outside. So I figured this I could inflate it and put it in my room. It would inflate and sit on the water, if there is water. It could sit on the beach. It's easy to clean because it's plastic. So we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. But I'm excited. Da, da, da. I'm bringing three puzzles. Three puzzles. I love puzzles. Um, I can never get enough freaking puzzles. Four tubes of extra toothpaste, because I like the Pro Nail brand. Hashtag no ad. Hashtag non-sponsored. Hashtag, yeah. Um, I'm bringing checkers and Uno. Face Max. This isn't even all of them, but this is like five or six, and this is like eight, and then there's four more up there that I haven't even packed yet. Um, bringing some classroom books. So in AmeriCorps, one thing that they did was they wrote, like, questions on a beach ball, and then they blew it up, and I thought that would be super fun for the classroom, for the, like, first week. And also, then I'll just have a beach ball, and I'll have stuff written on it, and it's fun, and I like it, and I'm into it. But I couldn't find one that was just normal, so I got the very glittery one. So we'll see how that works. So I went to the dollar store and Leonard spent like 15 bucks on stickers. That's this bag that I need to repack now.